this is Cliff from Seminole with another English tip. We can't emphasize enough how we have to use much with uncountable nouns, and we have to use many with countable nouns. Much is also going to fit in with adjective, and it's also going to fit in with verbs in certain sentences, because those things don't have number. Now, uh, there is a rule about the use of many and much, which you've got to keep in mind. We just use many in sentences that are questions or in negatives. So I can say, uh, I don't have much time, for example, because it's a negative sentence, where I could say, uh, do you have many people in your family? And we have to avoid putting many and much in affirmative sentences except when we're using formal writing. Now, in formal writing, many is used in the affirmative. So we can say there are many reasons to study English. However, much can't be used in the affirmative, even in formal writing. So when you need to use the affirmative, you're going to need to use the expression a great deal. We spent a great deal of time on the project. Thanks. See you next time.